Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to free up some hard disk space on your Windows 7 computer. So this should be a fairly quick and easy tutorial and we're going to jump right into it. So the first thing I'd recommend doing is heading over to the start button and just open it up. And now you want to type in programs and features. And the best match that comes up underneath control panel should say programs and features right here. You want to left click on that one time to open that up. And now if you notice any programs that are installed in here that you no longer need, I'd recommend uninstalling them. So you can notice if you scroll over on the right side here, you can see how large these programs are taking up on your computer. So if you have any programs you no longer use, I'd recommend just left clicking on them and then select uninstall up here and uninstall those programs. It's definitely a very good way to free up some hard disk space on your computer. After you do that, I'd recommend heading back to the start button and left clicking on it one time and typing in disk cleanup and the best match right underneath programs should say disk cleanup and you want to left click on that and this will launch the built-in disk cleanup wizard that is included in Windows 7 Okay, so we see we have disk cleanup open here. This will tell you the amount of disk space you'll gain by removing the files that are currently checked. Now you're more than welcome to scroll through here and add additional items. So if you wanted to add temporary files, you could add that as well. And depending on how often you run these scans, this could be a very large number right here. So once you've done that, you want to select OK. And then you'll be prompted, are you sure you want to permanently delete these files? You want to select delete files and this will take a moment so just be patient and there you go guys it's all about it and I do hope that these methods went over in this tutorial were able to help you out and as always thank you for watching and I will catch you in the next tutorial goodbye